Pasug naming pamamasyal sa Pedis. Tumungo naman kami sa tahanan ng mga kamag-anak niyang kumopkop sa kanya rito. Wow! wow. Parehas pa rin yung bahay. Grabe. Saan tayo ngayon, Esko? This is the house of my uncle and my aunt, sila Victor and Thelma Tabligan. Okay. And it looks exactly the same. You know? It's dito ka tumira for five years. Five years, yeah. And, you know, kinupkup nila ako, they took care of me. They treated me like their own talaga. Saka yan yung bahay nung ano, pag kumakanta ako. After yung... the shower, may malakas yung aking boto. <laughs> ano? Napatahimik ka, parang gano'n. Napasutsut ako. Shhh! Okay, let's try to go inside. Parehas pa rin nature mo. Ang daming tanim! Yan! Hindi ko naalala to. Exactly! Oh my gosh! More than 20 years na, can you imagine? Hello! Perfect! Wow! Hello! Gaya ng dati, mainit pa rin ang pagtanggap ng pamilyang ito kay Miss Koo. You look the same. Oo, totoo yan. Sino to? Anak ko. Yung nga. Dito matanda. Gosh. Hi, hello, ma'am. Pati si Tito, hindi siya nagbago. Si Drew po. Hi, ma'am. He's the host of Malik Bayan. Hi, hi, ma'am. Yeah. This is my aunt, Thelma Tabligan, my uncle. Before, these are my, ano, talagang the people who took care of me when I was here in Bacolod. Titing na kumu na. At hindi na nakatii si Miss Ku. Agad niyang pinuntahan ang dati niyang kwarto. Malaki na, malaki na. Sige. It's very small. This was my room before, pero iba na nakatira dito ngayon. I had my bed pa ganyan. Tapos, I would sing here on the top of my voice, and then yung tao dyan sa kapitbahay. Shut up! Shhh! Ganyan eh. Shhh! Di naman shut up. Shhh! Oo, dyan nakatira yung ano eh. Brown-eyed peas, yun. Shut up, shut up. Oh, no. Ay, hindi. Brown-eyed ba yun? Brown-eyed peas. Brown-eyed peas. Padoy, pumusali yan. Naiba na. Nagiba na itsura. Ay, ito! Oo nga! Oh, gosh! Aba, astiga! Ang sikat nating singer, may duguri palang painter. Tuwang-tuwa si Miss Kuna makitang nakadisplay pa rin sa bahay na ito ang kanyang simpleng work of art. Basically, I'm a painter kasi. When I was young, I used to paint a lot. So I have an appreciation for art. And siguro yun yung parang hindi ko natapos. Yun na yung painting. That's what I wanted to get actually. Pero higit na masaya si Miss Ku dahil muli niyang nakasama ang mga taong minsang tumulong at gumabay sa kanya. I really treated her like just one of my daughter, no? Because then he has a very good relation also with my own daughter. Yeah, when he was staying in that room, we had two or three other daughters on the other side. And we really enjoy his her company with us, and we really miss her. These people were really, were really, really wonderful to me. They, they treated me like their own, actually. Sundo hati di mga anak niya ako rin sundo hati. So she lahat di sa bakolod. The Lord was very good to me, and is still very good to me. Sana hindi siya magbago ng kanyang ugali na. Parang may respect sa mga matatanda na pag sa pamilya, matulungin siya. Kahit sinong, kahit sinong humingi ng tulong sa kanya pag nakita yung talagang kailangan. Hindi siya talaga lang umayaw. Alam mo, Drew, ito ang memorable na, ano, na place kasi outside of a very loving family that adopted me for five years. Dito yung mga ligawan na nangyayari. Ano, pila-pila yung mga boys? Well, because hindi naman. Mga one at a time. This is when, you know, we may kwentuhan, yung ganyan, syempre. Yan. Pag nakapasok na, that means serious na yun. Ah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. But I can see na parang everything fell into place. You know what I mean? Right. Yung pagpunta mo din sa Bacolod, you met this family na naging close ka. You know? And you know, for a while I was saying, grabe naman. Ba't naman nag-aaral pa ako ng five years in nursing, tapos kakanta lang pala ako, yung gano'n. Mm. Kaya pala, you know, later on, when I, you know, studying the Bible and all that, I realized in the pages of the Bible, it says there that God knows exactly 
where you are, and that is according to His plan. Kunyari sa buhay mo ngayon, you know, where you are or where I am right now is according to God's plan. So lahat yan walang tapon eh. Yung plan sa yun ni Lord is just amazing. 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 But I, if I go back to how my life has been, you know, in, from high school and then coming here, actually my first year here, I would cry myself to sleep because I was very close to my mother and all of a sudden, yung parang bigla ka na lang na win, no? right after uh, high school to college, biglang, you don't have a mom, you know, it's a whole new talk world to for almost, you. It's a whole new world, yeah. Ibang tao ito eh, di ba? They're practically strangers to me. But God was so good that He plucked me from Manila and put me in a family like this that is so loving, you know, and treated me just like